into the midfield role with Bugsy and Dan and the other two. And let's Dan Medley go forward a bit more so he likes it. On the left wing is Dan Huffin and on the right right wing is Rob Range. He's got up and down, hopefully it will. And then Adam and Jason up front. Uh, Bugsy, you got three kicks. And then corners is going to be in swinging. Dan and Bugsy, you right and left. So with Hillenden Park Rangers needing to win today, Reality FC take the goal kick by Wayne Huppin. It's with the midfield player for Hillenden Park Rangers who plays a long ball through, but it's cleared away, headed on by Adam Hughes. Ball not forward by Phil Bugs to Jason Newell who plays it inside. There's Adam Hughes in a bit of space, he turns. Good feet on Beats' man, he's brought down the edge of the area. That would have been a good moment for Hughes. Nonetheless, it's a free kick to Reality FC and there's Phil Bugs, hasn't scored this season. But here he is with his free kick. Takes his time. Hits that. It bends around the wall. It's flown into the bottom corner. And Reality FC take an early lead. He's deadly with that right foot of his, is Phil Bugs. And that was a great effort into the low bottom corner of the net. First goal of the season in the last game of the season for Phil Bugs. Next season could be big things for him. Here's Phil McGarvey in goal. It's a goal kick. Up to Adam Hughes, but wins the header, but it falls to the right back. Number seven, Finlandon Park Rangers, under pressure from Dan Huppin. Who wins it back and clears the ball. Phil Bugs can't collect. It's Hinden Park Rangers trying to get through this strong defensive unit of Reality FC. And there's Rob Range to Dan Medley, who goes down, keeps hold of the ball with two feet. Still got hold of the ball. Not letting go of that ball now, Dan Medley. <laughs> the ball is stuck between his legs like a magnet. That's a free kick to him and Park Rangers. Oh, sorry, you can see. Ball over the top. Oh, it's gone over the bar. It's a good bit of defending from Jason Newell, who's back to help out. Corner ball. Punched by Phil McGarvey into a great block by Wayne Huppin and... Had it not been cleared by Wayne Huppin, Anthony Cox was there as well, putting their bodies in the way of the ball, thrown from Hinden Park Rangers. Back to the left midfielder. Rich Adams puts the ball under pressure. Rob Range tries to clear. And it's Phil Bugs into Dan Medley. Nice ball over the top to Adam Hughes, who controls it. Looks to turn. Lovely ball through the middle for Jason Newell, who can't quite get there. And the ball is seen out for a throw in but now it's a goal kick Wayne Huppin with that one by Hillenden Park Rangers and again the second ball Anthony Cox makes up for the first header and clears the ball away good defending it's the throw from Hillenden Park Rangers it goes long knocked on oh good turn from 66 but it's held by Phil McGarvey who looks to go quick with the goal kick and he does Ball goes over the top and Adam Hughes finds himself in space here. What can he do? Oh, and it goes to the goalkeeper's hands. <laughs> Adam Hughes gives him a little pat on the shoulder. We'll see more about that relationship in the second half. Good take from Phil McGarvey on the second go and he takes that. Nice little roll out to Dan Huppin. Good break from reality here, perhaps. The ball falls to... The fullback, who knocks it inside to the centre back, but Jason Newell does well, battles well, and the play goes down. What's the referee going to give him? He gives a free kick to Reality FC. Jason Newell crashed into there. And here's Phil Bugs. Put good delivery in for his goal earlier on. What can he do here with the second set piece? It's a nice ball up there. There's Rob Range at the back post, looping header on! over the defenders into the goal that's 2-0 to Reality FC fantastic first half performance so far thrown from Rob Range to Phil Bugs Rob Range goes back to Rich Madams back to Rob Range with Rich Madams but the ball is won back by Hillenden and cleared away by Wayne Huppin to Dan Medley knocked on by Dan Huppin to Dan Medley again there's Adam Hughes making a nuisance of himself again. He's brought down, but referee says no. And the defenders... Oh, and Anthony Cox comes crashing in. 
the defensive midfielder, but the ball is eventually cleared away. And it looks like a corner <laughs> taken quickly by Reality FC. Dan Hopping to Rob Range. Rob Range looks to put the ball in. But it's away. There's Phil Bugs who turns and shoots. He's got a taste for goal now, but that just went wide. It's the defender for Hillenden. Plays it long to number seven who knocks it forward to the good tackle from Carl Drelin. There's Anthony Cox inside to Dan Huppin to Jason New who can't quite get hold of the ball and Hinland Park Rangers look to go all the way back to their goalkeeper oh good pressure from Jason on the ball falls to Adam Hughes who shows composure good feet oh and the ball is cleared good block from the defender great hounding from Jason Null Wayne Huppin with the goal kick again gives you an idea of the pressure reality we've been under in this half ball over the top Dan Huppin can't collect there's the striker holds it up nicely plays it out wide to the right midfield player can he get past Carl Drelin who's slightly off camera but he can he's delivered a good ball in oh it's snuck into the bottom corner and that's one back for Hillenden Park Rangers just before half time 2-1 to Reality FC so the second half underway Phil McGarvey with the ball looks to punt it up the pitch and he does it's a good kick ball let's bounce good pressure from Adam Hughes the ball now with Jason Null good pressure from Null the defender holds him off but no Jason Null no the defender wins that battle ball with the fullback it's forward to the striker good pressure from Wayne Huppin and Rich Maddams comes in as well Rob Range plays a lovely ball forward to Adam Hughes who holds the ball up well it's good strength from Hughes just holds it up plays it back to Rob Range who plays the ball back and that's intercepted by the striker that's a bad ball what can he do here can he beat Phil McGarvey he can't great pressure from Wayne Huppin Phil McGarvey gives one of his looks to Rob Range for that ball it's a let off corner ball to Hillenden ball comes in oh good pressure oh it's a missed chance for Hillenden Park Rangers knocked over the bar and Wayne Huppin goes down with cramp as some of the senior players discuss tactics suddenly no one cares about Wayne Huppin's injury anymore but some Tactical changes are to take place now. There's Jason Null. Plays it inside to Phil Bugs. There's a nice ball over the top. Two back to Jason Null. This one back by Hillenden. 66 tries some skill. But Rob Range has got the ball. There's Dan Medley. Looks to burst through the midfield. Jason Null now. This is good play from reality. It's a high ball up. There's Dan Happy. what can he do? He hits a shot and it's just gone wide of the approaching goalkeeper. Thrown from Hindenburg Park Rangers. Headed away by Rich Maddams and cleared by Phil Bugs. And the ball hits, oh it's a good block from Anthony Cox and the ball goes eventually into the safe hands of Phil McGarvey. It's a throw in from, to Phil Bugs, to Dan Happen, to Jason Null. But the ball is back with Hillenden. There's the substitute for Hendon but here's the left winger in a lot of room here 77 has a look up he plays the ball but only as far as Anthony Cox who does good defending there ball played back in still and the ball is cleared by Wayne Huppin it's a long clearance and Adam Hughes finds himself in space he goes for on goal here that's good burst of pace and he slots that into the goal as Reality FC expand their lead to 3-1 that's a great finish, great composure from the big man up front. 
Rob Range comes over to congratulate him. Thrown from Hillingdon Park Rangers who are applying the pressure. They really do need a win today if there's any hope of winning the league. The ball, there's Dan Medley. Does well to intercept. Wayne Huppin, nice little turn oh, to Phil Buggs. Ball over the top. Great ball. And there's Adam Hughes. Finds himself in space again. What can he do? Oh, he's unlucky. Just wide of goal. Could have been his second right. goal. Phil Bugs with the free kick. Straight into the hands of the keeper. And Adam Hughes puts good pressure on as he seeks another goal. And the goal has gone down injured. Adam Hughes does like this goalkeeper. I thought he was about to give him a little kiss there, but checks he's okay. Wayne up in with the goal kick. Doesn't go very far. Ball now with the winger. Looks to beat Carl Drill and he does there. It's gone past Wayne Huppin. He can even deliver a ball. He can, but Anthony Cox clears. Wayne Huppin away. But here come him the Park Rangers again. And the ball always oh, gone down. Player deemed to have brought him down, Wayne Huppin. And that's a penalty. Hindon Park Rangers given a lifeline. And the ball slotted into the centre of the goal. And that's 3-2 now to Reality FC. Last couple of minutes of the game now. Wayne Huppin can't clear. I'm not sure what he was doing. And the ball, oh, good goalkeeping from Phil McGarvey. Very brave, very strong. Collected the ball well. Dan Huppin's gone down. He gets back up. Here come Hindon Park Rangers. They look to find the equaliser from somewhere. The ball now with 77, it's a good turn. Not a lot of pressure on the number five. And the ball goes back to, oh dear, oh dear, it's 3-3. Free free. Dramatic equaliser for Hindon Park Rangers. Several times. See ya, cheers.